Today, I'm gonna steal Steven's supercar, the McSherry. I got the keys, so let's sneak out and let's get this bad boy out of the garage. Oh, just kidding. Actually, I'm gonna be a good sister today and do something super nice for Steven because, as you know, Steven has been going through a lot. And for the sharers who don't know what's been going on, ever since we moved into this brand new house, we've had the most worst luck ever. Well, we've had really bad luck, let's just say it that way. Every single car has broken down and some have even gotten destroyed. From the Sharagini, the Tesla, to the G-Wagon, and even my car. The day I was seeing Steven's house for the first time. We should have known then that that was just the start of our very bad luck. Luckily, the McLaren has been the only car that hasn't broke down. One of the reasons why we moved into this house and picked this house out is because it has so many garages, so many cars from there, all all the way circling around. It's a semicircle of garages. But we only have two spots that are filled. The rest are empty because the other cars are at the shop. Yeah, tell me, that is a lot of bad luck. So today, I'm gonna surprise Steven. I'm gonna go shopping online and get him a nice big present, especially. What is that? I got a new subscriber. Oh my goodness, that's right, Sharers. Make sure you hit the subscribe button right now because I get notified each time someone subscribes. So I get to see your face, your name, when you hit the subscribe button. So subscribe right now. I'm gonna go shopping online to get the most extravagant gift for Steven. Especially after all the sadness he's had from, you know, all those cars breaking down. He's really been feeling under the weather. In fact, I haven't even seen him today. I don't really know where he is because I know he's really stressed about the cars. Oh my goodness. Wait, this no way. I can't believe they sell this online. This will be perfect and place. Oh yeah, it's place. This is gonna be awesome. I can't wait for him to open up this nice big surprise. So today I'm going to, I don't know what I should do today. Cheers, comment down below what your favorite hobbies are. Is it crafts? Is it sports? I'm looking for some new hobbies to do, so comment down below things I should try. Oh yes, I love when I get that notification and the package is delivered, and especially today because this package is Steven's big, big surprise that I got for him. Okay, we gotta go. We gotta go get the package. Let's go, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go get the package. Woohoo! Oh, I don't see the package. Oh no. Sometimes the delivery people get so confused because there's so many doors. So I'm sure it's just right over here. Oh uh, well, that's the recycle. I know that looks like packages. And then here's one. Oh yes. Okay, this isn't it, but this is my ring light. So our ring light got delivered. Let's bring this in. You bring this in. Okay. Do you want me to go to the front door? Come this way. Heading to the front door, you might be wondering why I didn't walk through the house. Well, that's because we have painters and they're painting right in the front lobby. I didn't want to disturb them. We got a lot of packages. I can definitely say this is not what I ordered. This is an office desk. This is a glass mirror. This is another office desk. One for me, one for Steven. Oh, what's this? Whoa. Uh oh, Hope that wasn't breakable. No, this is a rug. Okay. Well, that's not it. Let's go actually to the front door up here. Nothing. Boy, I hate when this happens. When you order something and you can't figure out where the package is. Does this happen to anybody else? Anybody else relate? It says it got delivered and you have no idea where it is. Come on, let's go. It says delivered. I put the right address. Oh, wait, photo. It shows they got it delivered right to that first door I opened. Did I miss it? And it said it showed it right here. Oh, well, where is the package? Maybe the package had some feet and it took a little stroll down the stairs. I don't know. I clearly am not going crazy because I don't see any package. Sure, did you see a package? Nothing. Maybe I should check with Steven. Maybe he got to the package before me. Hey Siri, call Steven Share. Calling Steven Share Mobile. Oh, hey, Steven. Hey, what's up? Oh, I was just looking for a package, and um, it's not there, so I was wondering where it went. Well, did it get delivered? I thought maybe you got it. No, I didn't, I didn't get anything. I haven't even left the house today. You didn't bring any packages in today? No, I've been in my room all day. Why? Did you see any packages? Just check the security cameras. They'll let you know where the packages got dropped off. Yeah. Yeah, I could. Yeah, I'm sure it's at the front door. Well, Steven said he didn't touch any packages. Can't tell if he's pranking me or not. There's only one way to find out, and it's to check the security footage. Let's see where the package went. Soon enough, the evidence will be revealed. If Steven's pranking me, or if someone took it? Can't imagine, but let's check the security footage. Okay. <gasps> Motion detected. So we need to find the delivery person. This camera? The delivery guy was going to the front door. Okay, so he saw the sign, because we have a sign out there that says, uh, deliver the packages to the door that we checked. So, okay, good thing you saw that. And then, looks like he's walking over there. Okay, so let's switch cameras. 
Okay. There he is. With the package that definitely looks like the same package that they took a photo of. This has to be the delivery person. Walking over. Let me do door view. There he is, coming up to the door with the package in his hand. So I why it's not there. Puts it down. And then he's still looking at it. What is he doing? He took a photo of it. He literally took a photo. Let me zoom in. See, he took a photo of the package. So where did the package go? This shows that it should still be there and the delivery guy did it perfectly. He read the sign and went over there. So I'm so confused. <laughs> where is my package? Grace, look, there's another notification. Oh, you're right. There is another notification. <gasps> Motion, front door. Oh my goodness, wait, who is that? It looks like it was 10 minutes after the delivery arrived. Oh, you're right, look at the timestamp. Oh my goodness, who is that? Kinda looks suspicious and we weren't expecting anyone else to come today, right? No. This is so scary. They're definitely suspicious. <gasps> Wait, they're looking through the pile of, oh my goodness, oh my goodness, Sharers, do you see this? They're looking through a pile of packages out front. And look at the outfit. Yeah, that is so suspicious. They're literally sifting through our packages. I wonder if they took one of those. Wait, I wonder if they took my surprise package. Why would they go over there and take mine when there's some right there? Okay, okay, this is super suspicious. Can we go here? <gasps> Oh my goodness! They went up to the front door. That is so close to the house. And then, what do they do up there? <gasps> oh my goodness! That is right over there. They were peeking through our window. Okay, this person is definitely suspicious. Shares, if you have any idea who this person is, zoom in, screenshot, comment down below who this person is. I have a feeling they stole my package. Walking up the stairs, and... Oh no! They took my package! That is a package pirate. I never thought they were real, but they're real pirates that steal the packages. We need to figure out who this person is. I'm gonna try and zoom in. Whose face is that? So hard to tell. Oh my goodness, this is so bad. I can't believe someone would dare to steal a package. <sighs> this is so not good. You know what? I need to save these clips, send them to me. Now I can really zoom in on this person. We need to figure out who this person is. Okay, that's the person. Pause it, zoom in, screenshot. Who is that? Shares, comment down below if you have any idea who this person is. At least we have some sort of evidence of their face. I wish we had a better angle. I guess that one's kind of a better angle. Okay, let's zoom in on there. I can't can't really tell if I know that person or not. Wait a second. No. Oh my goodness. I think I actually might know who this person is. Shares, listen up very closely. Do you think this person looks like, and I need your advice on this, please be honest. Does this person look like the same person that bumped and damaged the G-Wagon? Okay, let me try to pull up a photo of each side by side. Do these two people look the same? The person who broke the G-Wagon be a suspicious person? Shares, comment down below right now. Is the person who stole the package the same person that damaged the G-Wagon? Comment, comment, comment. I need your help. I'm gonna do some research. Maybe I'll call the police and I'll see you in the next vlog. Show to love. Peace. This is not good.